So as far as uh, passport bros dating overseas, which are men that leave the U.S. to go to a lot of different countries. Um, and you, you told me off camera, where are you from again? Like you're in the city? So um, well, I'm from the Bronx, but I live in Brooklyn. All right. As far as like your background, your ethnicity? Dominican and Puerto Rican. Okay. Right. So a lot of guys go to Dominican Republic. They go to a lot of these type kind of countries to seek more traditional women. What are your thoughts on men that do that? You know, that kind of just want to find something different. How do you feel I, about that? I feel like it's okay to do it because, you know, maybe they can't find nothing in New York. Wait, pause. Can I curse? Yeah, yeah. Because I curse a lot. So I had to make talk sure. Your shit, talk your talk. <laughs> so I feel like it is okay to like, you know, travel and like, you know, meet people from other places because to be honest, New York bitches really ain't it. So, you know, you got to go somewhere else to find something that you like and, you know, something that's good for you and what you're looking for. So if you got to travel, fuck it. Right, right. And when, when you say New York girls ain't it, what do you mean by that? Like, like in general? The bitches nowadays, like, shit, like all they want to do is go out, drink. Like half of them don't even have a job. They don't even know how to cook, clean. Like all you see them posting is outside. When are you cooking? Always eating outside food. Where's the good food at? Like, come on now. You got a point. You got a point. Because guys like that. Like, even if it's not, like, just the fact that she made the food, you're like, yo, I like that. That's fire. Like, she made that for me. But overseas, they do that. Yeah. You know, like, I know a lot of dudes that go, and they get that treatment all the time. So, you kind of feel like it makes sense, like, because over there, you get that treatment. But over here, girls don't know how to cook, clean, or nothing. Or they, or they got an issue with it. Yeah. Right, right. And how else do you feel like these girls are like, they really ain't it, you know, as far as wifey material? Oh, snap. Wifey material? Um, I did an episode on this. Well, my wifey material, half of these bitches, especially in New York, they all ran through. Either they fucking your bros, maybe father, you never know. These yeah, bitches is sneaky nowadays. But that's a part of it. Like nowadays, like females is out here just fucking anybody. And I feel like men don't want that type of female who have a ran through female. Even if like you show your man's like, yo, bro, like I'm fucking with this bitch. Then your man's is like, oh, I fucked her last night type shit. It be like that. Nowadays, because, you know, bitches be outside clubbing and doing all this extra shit. And remember, it's a small ass world. It's New York. You gonna, you gonna, it's gonna catch up to you. And also, like I said before, bitches don't cook, clean, like they never home. Some of the, these bitches don't even have a crib, don't have nothing going for them. Some of them don't even go to, like they didn't even probably graduate high school. Cause there's a lot of dropouts nowadays. Like in this generation, the way you can make money, they rather make money fast, doing OnlyFans, you know, on bartending, or this extra shit instead of finishing school. Facts, facts.